I think we can start now because now we all have 17 participants. Okay, it's okay. I think I have to start. Okay, before we start our lesson, let recite the all together. One, two, three. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Allahumma aktam alayna hikmataka wa insyur alayna min khaza ini rahmatika ya arhamar rahimin. Rabbi shrahli sadri wa yasirli amri wahlul uhdatan min lisani yafkahu kawli. Rabbi zidni ilman warzukni fahman. Amin. Okay, let's start lesson for today. Okay, last week, teacher already do a little bit revision um, in topic animals. Okay, do you still remember you have learned about the body parts of animal? Do you still remember? Okay, good. Kalau remember, tunjuk thumbs up dekat, dekat teacher. Okay, so I want to ask and I will call your name. Okay, I will choose a few of you to answer my question. Okay. So now I want to ask Abdullah Zubair. Hi Abdullah. Yeah. Okay. Last week we have learned about the body parts of animal. Can you tell me what is the body part of horn? Uh, sorry, sorry. For horse. The horse oh. ada body part apa? Ada. Tail. Okay, very good. Ada tail. Lagi ada apa lagi dekat body dia? Hmm. Ni apa ni? Ada apa ni? Hmm. Ni apa? Hmm. Okay, hey. Okay, ada. Kalau body parts of um horse, dia ada, dia ada tail and ada head, ada kepala. Okay, thank you Abdullah. Next oh, animal. Okay, I want to ask Jenna. Okay, Jenna, I want to ask you for snail. What body parts that snail have? Shell. Okay, very good, Jenna. Okay, snail ada shell. Okay, thank you, Jenna. Okay, next, I want to ask. Hmm. Okay, Nabiha Rahman. Okay, Nabiha Rahman, can you hear me? Yes. Okay, can you tell me what body part for bird? Bird ada apa? Nabiha, I can hear you. Hai Nabiha. Nabiha tak bergerak so I think I have uh, I should ask someone else maybe I will ask Yes, Wazif. Okay, for bird, apa body part of bird? Ah, bird ada apa? Ada apa untuk terbang? To fly. What body parts of yes. bird? Okay, wings. Thank you, Wazi. Very good. Okay, kalau bird ada wing. Okay, next. Um, okay, uh, teacher nak tanya Lily. Okay, Lily. Kalau dia rusa, rusa ada apa? Yang tajam tu. The body part of dia apa? Kuat sikit, teacher tak dengar. Loud. <laughs> I can hear your voice. Horn, teacher nampak mulut dia macam dia sebut horn. Okay, thank you Lily. Okay, I have to admit your friends. Wait for a while. Okay. Okay. Okay, very good Lily. Ada horn. Okay, next. I want, thank you Lily. Next, I want to ask, okay, Balkis. Okay, what 
body parts for duck. Duck ada apa? Rabbit feet. Okay, very good. Barkis, thank you. Rabbit feet. Dia punya kaki untuk berenang tu. Rabbit feet ada dekat duck and also frog. Okay, thank you. Very good, Barkis. Okay, I think all of you already know the parts of animals. Then I want to proceed why the body part of animal is very important. Okay, let me share with you my slide. Okay. Hi Amna Anma. Kenapa Anma punya muka terbalik Amna? Amna, eh Anma. Anma Safia. Terbalik tu. Upside down ni awak punya muka ni. Okay, I will share my slide. So that we will do uh, revision. Lepas tu kita jawab buku aktiviti eh. Okay, can you see my slide? Nampak tak slide teacher? Okay, good. Okay, I will make it slide show. Okay. Okay, so now I will do a revision. Why the body part is very important to animal. Okay, the importance of part of the body. Okay, look at here. Every part of animal, ah, baru nak start ada pula orang conteng teacher punya ni. Sekejap ya, teacher kena disable. Ha, teacher nak ajar. Siapa nak tolong teacher? Okay, it's okay Alpha. Okay, Siti Asia. Siti Asia want to help me. Asia want to help me to explain about the body part of a crocodile. Mana Asia tadi? Where is Asia? Where? Mana nama Asia? Okay, yes, Siti Asia. Asia. Hi, Siti Asia. Uh, hi. Explain. Huh? Oh, nak tu kita explain. Ah, uh, nak. Okay. Okay, crocodile ni ada apa? Ah, uh, wet feet, hard dengan hard skin dengan hard skin dengan tail. Okay, why hard skin is very important to crocodile? To protect themselves. Okay, very good. To protect themselves. Thank you, Asia. Okay. Sekejap ya. Senang. Okay, as you can see here, hard skin ada dekat crocodile. And this is very important for crocodile to protect itself. So, kalau ada binatang dekat dia nak gigit ke apa, ah, uh, this hard skin can protect the body of the crocodile. Okay, next. As you can see here, frog. Frog ni dia ada webbed feet. Nampak kaki dia. And webbed feet ni is very important for frog ah, uh, for swimming. Frog pun duduk dalam air juga. So, the webbed feet will help frog to swimming. Okay, it same goes to fish. Fish ada tail. Then, dia ada fin. Okay, this also will help fish ah, uh, for swimming. Okay, that's why the body part, certain body part of the animal is very important to themselves. Okay, so that they can protect or they can move in. Okay, let's look at to the next slide. Okay, 
Okay, look at here. Rhinoceros and buffalo. Okay, rhinoceros and by buffalo. They have horn. Uh, horn bone, very important to them because this horn will help this animal to protect themselves. So, kalau ada enemy, ada musuh dia datang, uh, dia boleh guna horn ni untuk lawan. Uh, horn ni tajam. So, kalau ada binatang lain nak makan ke, nak datang dekat dia, they will use this horn to protect themselves. Okay, next. You can see butterfly and also bird. Both of these animals, they have wing. Wing is very important for them to fly. So, they fly ni untuk apa? Untuk cari makanan, untuk cari tempat tinggal. So, the wing is very important for animal. Okay, next slide. Show you next slide. Okay, we are similar. Okay, look at here. Hafiz have collect several different picture of animal from magazine. So Hafiz identify that the cow, cat, hamster and rabbit have fine hair. Okay, empat-empat binatang ni adalah different animal but they have ah similar characteristic. These four animal, they ada fine hair. Okay, lembu, dia ada fine hair, this hamster, cat and also rabbit. Okay, walaupun this is different animal but they have uh, similar body part. Contohnya, fine hair. Okay, wait for a while, okay? Okay, let me proceed to the next page. Okay, you can see here. Okay, this is animal. Um, chicken atau roaster. Okay, animal ni. They, uh, this animal have the different parts of body. Okay, dia ada, dia ada beak, dia ada wing, dia ada tail and also leg. And the body part of this animal is very important. Like, okay, number two. State the importance of this part to the animal. Like, number two A. Okay, this is a, this is a webbed feet. So, this is very important for the animal to swimming. Okay, this one, for bird, they must have wing to fly. So, kalau burung tu wing dia sebelah tak, uh, tak boleh, sebelah sakit boleh tak dia terbang? Uh, tak boleh. Wing tu dua-dua kena elok. Kalau satu elok, satu tak elok, tak boleh terbang. So, uh, wing is very important to um, bird for them to fly. And then C, C ni shell. Shell ni ada dekat tortoise, ada dekat snail and shell ni is very important so that they will uh, protect themselves. Sebab tu kalau snail, dia tengah jalan-jalan, tiba-tiba awak pegang dia, awak sentuh dia punya uh, antenna tu nanti dia akan masuk dalam shell dia sebab dia nak protect themselves. Same goes to tortoise. Tortoise tu tengah jalan tiba-tiba awak pegang kepala dia. Uh, dia akan masuk inside the shell to protect themselves. Okay. Maybe this one is the last slide. Okay. We just recall. Okay, this is big. Big ni uh, burung punya mulut. Uh, dia punya paruh eh, beak, scale, biasanya scale ni dekat fish, fin ni uh, dekat fish juga, fin ni untuk help um, fish to swimming. Then the body part that you have learned, head, uh, kepala, semua binatang ada kepala. Then body, tail, wing, horn and horn is very important to certain animal for them to protect themselves. Then shell, antenna. Uh, antenna ni ada dekat uh, certain insect. Contohnya butterfly, uh, dragonfly. Okay, they have antenna. Then hard skin. 
hard skin ni uh, example animal that have hard skin is crocodile okay to protect themselves juga okay fine hair ah uh, ni contoh fine hair binatang yang ada bulu lembut je uh, maybe some of you um, ada pet hamster ke uh, cat ke uh, they will have fine hair and then feather feather ni um, bulu bulu apa ni bulu apa kita panggil um, bulu pelepah ya eh, dekat wing ataupun dekat chicken dekat bird ah dia ada feather ni then last kali adalah webbed feet and webbed feet ni is very important to certain animal for them to swim okay now i think we can proceed to the activity book oh ada yang mengantuk tu teacher nampak take a break that Okay, tarik nafas paling panjang. Breathe in, breathe out, breathe in, breathe out. Okay, if you feel sleepy, you can stand up and jump three times. If you feel sleepy, uh, you can stand up and jump three times. Okay, Lily, I can see you jump. <laughs> Ah uh, yes, Balkis too. I can see you jump. Okay, so I will stop share my uh, slide and we can proceed to our activity book. So, ready with your activity book? Take your activity book. Ready with your pencil. Uh, after this, we will um, do it the exercise together. Okay, good Hazim. I can see you. Yes, Hanan. Okay. Okay, this time I want to ask you the answer. Okay, let me share the activity book. Okay. Open page 29, muka surat 29. Okay, muka surat 29, open page 29. Okay, this is unit 5, open page 29. Okay, question number 1. Part of animal. Okay, the question asks you, you have to label the parts of the animal. So, this number one is dragonfly. So, now I want to ask Aisha Al Humaira. Okay, can you tell me what is the body part of this dragonfly? Okay, this one number one. Apa dia number one is eh? Teacher tulis number dulu. Okay, this number one. Apa body part of this animal? Number one eh? Wings. Sekejap. Okay, teacher tunjuk dulu. Number one, this one. Okay, apa body, uh, sorry, apa body part ni? Hmm, tail. Okay, tail. Tapi kalau untuk serangga ni, kita panggil dia abdomen eh. Abdomen. Okay, this body part is abdomen. Okay, lagi ni apa? Yang kedua ni, sekejap teacher tunjuk. Okay. What body part of this? Ni apa ni? Wing. Okay, very good. Wing. Okay, you write the answer here. Wing. Okay, another one. What is this? Hmm? This one. Head. Bukan, dia yang tajam ni. Bukan head, dia yang tajam ni. Dia panggil apa? Dia panggil sesungut dalam bahasa Melayu. Okay, we call it antenna. Okay, write the answer. Okay, 
Okay, dragonfly, they have antenna, wing and also abdomen. Abdomen tu dia punya badan yang panjang tu. Okay, Hafi Anaki. You raise your hand. Ya, yeah. okay, thank you Aisyah Humaira. Okay, kita nak cari nama Hafi Anaki. Mana Hafi Anaki? Okay, maybe Hafi Anaki want to give me the answer for animal number two. Lily, what are you doing Lily? Ha, have you copied the answer? Sekejap kita cari apa nama tadi. Um, Hafi Anaki. Hafi Anaki muka teacher tak nampak lah. Tunjuklah muka teacher tak kenal Hafi Anaki ni. Yang mana? Okay. Hafi Anaki. Okay. Look at here. What is the body part of this animal? Okay. Ni apa ni? What is this? Tail. Okay. Tail. Very good. Okay. Teacher write the answer here. Tail. Okay. Next. Okay, what is this? Dekat body dia ada apa? Ha, apa dia Hafi Anaki? At the body, at the body of this animal. Ada apa ni? Fine hair, teacher right here. Fine hair. Ada uh, rambut yang halus dekat sini. And lastly here. Okay, what this animal have? Uh, yang tajam ni apa ni? Horn. Okay, very good. Horn. Okay, thank you Hafi Anaki. Okay, you can write the answer. Horn. Okay, H Okay, th thank you Hafi Anaki. Okay, the rest, write the, the answer. Amirul Farhan, do you have your activity books? Tak ada. Okay, nanti dekat rumah. Kat rumah ke? Okay, nanti buat ya kat rumah ya. Okay, have you done? Copy the answer. Okay, Hazim said done. Okay, good. Okay, if you're done, we can proceed to the next page. Okay, proceed to the next page. Okay, look at page number 330. Okay, open page 330. Okay. Okay, this is about the importance of part of the body. Okay, why certain body parts of the animal is very important. Okay, look at number one, A. Okay, you can see there is buffalo and also rhinoceros. Buffalo and rhinoceros ni, ah, dia ada same characteristic. Ada benda yang sama dekat dua-dua ni. That is horn. So, what is the function of horn? Who can tell me? Who can give me the answer? Teacher nak tanya. Dia Hana. Okay, why horn is very important to buffalo and rhinoceros? Horn ni help this animal to apa? Hmm. Yes, Dia Hana. Why horn is very important to this animal? Tanduk dia penting kena, kenapa? Protect. Okay, to protect themselves. Very good, Diahana. Thank you. 
Okay, this horn is very important to protect themselves. Okay, you can write the answer. Thank you, dear. Okay, write the answer. Right, Kalariski, have you done? Okay, horn is very important to animal because this horn will protect themselves. Protect themselves from enemies. So, kalau ada musuh datang, nak datang kat dia, nak lawan, uh, they will use this horn. Sebab tu kalau awak datang dekat kerbau ke lembu ke uh, Kalau awak buat dia marah uh, Dia akan guna dia punya horn ni untuk kejar Untuk protect dia punya diri uh, Dia boleh tanduk lah orang yang kacau dia So horn is very important for this animal To help them to protect themselves Okay have you done? Copy the answer Okay dah siap Kita want to proceed to the next Question. Okay, Zari said dah teacher. Okay, good. Okay, kita nampak ada yang tengah tulis lagi. We wait for your friends. Okay, Abdullah Zubair also done. Okay, Wazif also done. Good. Okay, yes, teacher nampak awak buat macam ni. Okay, can you can we proceed to question number two? Okay, this is bird and also dragonfly. Okay, bird and dragonfly, they have wing. So why wing is very important to them? Okay, I want to ask. Ah, uh, tadi Hafi Hafi Anaki dah jawab. Bisa tanya orang lain pula. Yes, Hazim. Why wings very important to this animal? Yes, Hazim. Sekejap, teacher rasa teacher dah unmute awak dah. Sekejap eh. Teacher dah tekan unmute dah. Ah, okay. Why wing is very important to this animal? Wings to help to help them fly. Okay, very good. Wing is very important to uh, this animal, bird and dragonfly, for them to fly. Okay, thank you, Hazi. Okay, write your answer. Okay, done. Okay, so see, this is fish and also frog. So this fin and webbed feet help this animal to white. Okay, this webbed feet and also fins will help this animal to what? Teacher nak tanya siapa yang? Uh, okay, Nabiha Rahman. Okay, Nabiha Rahman. Fin and webbed feet will help this animal to what? Swim. Okay, swim. Will help this animal to? Uh, swimming. Untuk berenang. Okay, thank you, Nabiha. Very good. Okay, write your answer.
Okay, can we proceed to the next page? Hmm, Atira said that she pernah tengok uh, dragonfly. Siapa tak pernah tengok dragonfly? Ada yang tak pernah tengok? Ah, uh, semua dah tengok bagus. Okay, next let's proceed to page 31. Okay. Page 31. Muka surat 31. Okay. These animals are classified according to their similar parts of their body. Okay, there is different animal, but ah uh, Hazim belum lagi ah uh, cepat Hazim. Kita bagi thirty second for you to complete. Okay, ready? Okay, this uh, exercise, okay, as you can see, there are different animal. Okay, group A, they are different animal, but they have similarity. Same goes to group B. They have, di this one is different animal, but they have similar part of their body. Okay, now look at group A. Take the similar part of the body for each group. For group A, they are different animals. Here is butterfly, uh, grasshopper and also cockroach. Okay, mm -hmm. they are different animals. But what is their similarity? Okay, I want to ask Aira Rayana. Aira. Okay, Aira Rayana. Okay, look at the group A. Ada butterfly, grasshopper and also cockroach. They are different animals but what is the similarity between them? Apa yang sama dekat dia? Itu will unmute you. Can you give me the answer? Kan tak boleh unmute ni. <laughs> Okay, tak apalah teacher tanya yang lain. I want to ask Zafira Natasha. Okay, Zafira Natasha. Yeah, okay. Group A, butterfly, cockroach and also uh, grasshopper. What is their similarity? You know, dia ada apa yang sama dekat sini? What is the similarity between them? Okay, set right high. You want to go to toilet? Okay, go. Okay, dia Hana, you give me the correct answer. Very good. Yes, yeah, Zafira. Apa jawapan ni? Apa yang sama dekat dragonfly, grasshopper and cockroach? Apa yang sama dekat situ? Dia boleh terbang. So, dia ada apa? Dengar lah. I can hear you. Ah, dia ada wing to fly. Okay, teacher tak dengar suara awak Zafira. It's okay lah. Okay, these three of the animal, they have wing. Satu lagi dia ada apa? Dia ada wing and satu lagi dia ada apa yang panjang ni? Satu lagi teacher nak tanya 
Ah, Lily, ada apa yang panjang tu Lily? Ah, Lily, what do they have? What is the similarity? Apa lagi selain wing? Teacher show you ah ni apa ni? Kenapa tak dengar suara awak? Kuat sikit. Tengok. Teacher nampak mula awak jawab. Okay, antena. <laughs> okay, good Lily. I can see your mouth. Teacher boleh nampak suara awak tapi... Okay, very good. Group A, they have wing and also antenna. Okay, group B, what is their similarity? Teacher nak tanya Amirul Farhan. Ha, apa yang sama dekat group B tu? Amirul Farhan. Okay, teacher unmute awak ya. Okay, Amirul Farhan. Nail, crab and also uh, this nail. What do they have? What is crab the... has claw. Crab has claw. What is the body part of this animal? Apa yang sama? The body part here that we have learned. Okay, Balkis, you give body. me... Okay, Balkis, you give me the correct answer. Okay, what is this? This, uh, this nail, what is this? Okay, I will draw for you. Okay, what is this um, Farhan ni? This one. This is we call what? Uh, Amira Farhan, what we call this? Shell. Okay, shell. Okay, thank you, Amirul. Oh, tak kau nak awak dah angkat tangan dah. Okay, Atirah, good. Okay, at this group B, they are different animal but they have a similar body part. That is shell. Okay, write your answer here. Shell. Okay, write your answer. Okay, have you done? I want to proceed to the next page, uh, next question. Okay. Okay, next question. You have to name other animal that have similar body parts of the body. Okay, kalau group A, beside butterfly, grasshopper and cockroach, what is other animal that also have wing and also antenna? Uh, who can give me example? Other animals? Yes, yes. Aisha Al-Humaira. Okay, Aisha apa dia? Dragonfly. Oh yes, very good. Dragon fly. Uh, Dragon fly ni ada dua-dua. Wing ada. Dia punya apa? Antena pun ada. Dragon fly. Okay, very good, Aisha. Okay, next for group B. What is other animal that also have shell beside nail and crab? Ah, who can give me the answer? You can put out your hand. Ah, binatang apa lagi ada shell? Okay, Jenna, you put out your hand. Turtle. Okay, turtle. Okay, turtle. Very good. Turtle ataupun tortoise. Good. Oh. Please. Okay, you can write the answer and I give you break two minutes. Okay, copy the answer and I give you break two minutes before we proceed to the next page.
Okay, done. Okay, all of you done. Okay, if you're done, we can proceed to the next page. Open page 32. Muka surat 32. Okay, now you have to label the body part of this animal. As you can see, here have three different animal: butterfly, dragonfly, and also housefly. These three animal have similarity. Tiga tiga hewan ni lain, tapi they have similarity. Okay, what is their similarity here? Teacher nak tanya, ah, teacher dah nampak dah Aisyah Humaira tunjuk tu. Tapi teacher nak tanya orang lain. Teacher nak tanya Wazif. Okay, Wazif, can you tell me what is the similarity between butterfly, dragonfly and also housefly? Apa yang sama kat sini? Apa dia cakap lagi sekali tak dengar. Okay, between three, these three animal, okay, dragonfly, butterfly, and also housefly, what is the body part that are similar between them? Apa yang sama? Apa yang sama antara tiga-tiga uh, binatang ni? Yang boleh dia terbang. Apa dia yang boleh terbang? Dragonfly. Okay, what is the body part? Apa part mana yang menyebabkan dia boleh terbang? Part apa? Fly. Yeah, dia fly guna apa? Wings. Okay, the answer here, wings. So, wing is the body part. Uh, so, you have to label the part of the body. Okay, you write there, wing. Okay, thank you, Azif. Okay, write wing. Okay, teacher right here, wing. Sama juga fly ni pun ada wing. Same goes to dragonfly, ada wing. So, these three animal, they have wing. Yes, Rifan. Rifan dah salin dah? Dah, wing. Okay, good Rifan. Okay, for question number, okay, have you done? Tulis tiga-tiga. Okay, dah siap. Okay, next question number one. Are these animal the same? Sama ke tiga-tiga animal ni? Sama tak? Teacher nak tanya Rifhan. Sama. Ah, sama ke? Ni butterfly, ni fly, ni dragonfly. Sama tak binatang ni? Ah. Tidak sama. Okay, no. Are these animal same? No. Okay, write your answer here. No. Tapi apa yang sama between the three animal? Wing. Okay, very good. 
Okay, thank you. Um, apa nama tadi? Rifan. Okay, do the animal have similar part of the body? Yes. Okay, apa yang sama tadi tu? We. Okay, you write here. Yes. So, okay, write the answer. Okay then, so I proceed with question number three. So this one I have to delete. Okay, look at question number three. Okay, we have to complete the conclusion below. Okay, as you know, these are three different animals. Okay, they are three different animals, but they have same or similar body part. Okay, you just copy here. They are different. They are different animals, but they have same part of the body. Contohnya yang sama tadi adalah we. Okay, write your answer. They are different animals, but they have they have same part of the body. Okay, have you done? Done? Dah siap? Hmm, tu dah macam ngantuk je tu. Okay, have you done? Hazim said done. Have you done? Okay, Alpha also show me done. Barkis done. Lily done. Ain done. Aisyah done. Lagi? Hanan dan Dia dan Zena dan Aisyah dan Rania Ismi dan oh, Rania teacher nampak tangan je Muka tak nampak lah Amna dan Okay good Okay so let's proceed to the next page Muka surat 33 Okay maybe this is the last page 33 Okay, open page 33. Okay, on the drawing. Okay, let's proceed to the page 33. Okay, boleh dengar suara teacher? Can you hear me? Okay, good. Okay, here as you can see, there are two different animals. Hamster and also buffalo. Okay, here we have hamster and also buffalo. Okay, what should you do? You have to tick, tanda kan right. You have to tick the suitable box. Okay, for example here, the part of the body for hamster. Hamster ada head tak? 
Kalau ada head, okay, you tick here, correct, you tick here. You tick like this, ah. Yes, buffalo, they, they have head. Buffalo ada kepala? Yes. Okay, head, yes. Okay, the, do the hamster have body? Teacher nak tanya siapa ya? Teacher tak tanya lagi. Teacher kena tanya supaya teacher tahu nama awak. Uh, yes, Alpha. Okay, Alpha. Okay, do the hamster have body? Yes or no? Yes. yes. Okay. Um, buffalo have body or no? Yes. Okay, yes. Very good. Okay, you take here like this. Okay, next I want to ask. Yes, Nukman. Okay, Nukman. This hamster have tail or no? Yes. Okay, good. Yes. Buffalo. Yes. Yes, okay. Very good, Nukman. Thank you. Okay, next I want to ask Umar Majdi. Umar Majdi. This hamster have fine hair? Yes. Okay, very good. Yes. The buffalo have fine hair? Yes. Okay, good. Yes, okay. You tick at the correct And answer. the buffalo die. Uh, Are you either the spooky, like the like rip or rip or the like or like a rip or like a rip buffalo? You like a rip buffalo? Okay. You sure yeah. you like a rip? Did you want to ask? Like a spooky buffalo, like that. Okay, Umar Majdi, thank you. Next, I want to ask. Um, uh, siapa lagi ya? Who else I want? Yes, Balkis. Okay, this hamster. Okay, I will unmute you. Okay, this hamster have horn or not? No. Oh, okay, very good. This buffalo have horn or no? Yes. Yes. Okay. Have to take here. Okay, have you done? Take the correct answer. Okay, good. Thank you, Balkis. Ain Suraya, have you done? Okay, good. Darish, have you done, Darish? Darish dah siap? Okay, good. I can see you. Thumbs up. Okay, next. Okay, the last question here. You have to color the correct answer. Okay, these are different or same animal? Um, teacher nak tanya Hanan. Hanan, can you hear me? Mana Hanan? Ya, Hanan tak ada. Okay, Jenna. Okay, Jenna. Okay, these are different or same animal? Different. Buffalo. Same or different? Different. Okay, different. These are different animals. This one you have to color. They are different animals, but they have different or same part of the body. Same. Okay, that's it. But they have same part of the body. Okay, color the correct answer. Okay, I think I can proceed another page. 34. Okay, that's it. Okay. Yeah. Okay, thank you Jenna. Teacher It's proceed to the last page. Okay, kita habiskan tajuk ni terus. 
Okay. This is the last page or the last exercise for topic anymore. Okay, to complete the body parts of mm. this animal. This is what? Crocodile goldfish. Okay, you have to. Okay, this is page 34. Yeah. Um, right, 34. 34. Okay, you have this to is what? The correct answer. Yes. Okay. What animal is mm -hmm. crocodile or fish? I want mm -hmm. to ask. Mm -hmm. I want to ask. Um, car. Car. Are you there, car? Hi, car. Uh, it's okay, lah. Teacher will proceed with uh, the answer. Okay, the answer. The missing part of the body is apa? Apa yang tak ada? Finger skin. Apa dia punya sayap kat tepi ni? Kita panggil apa? Skin. Ha. Okay, this is a, as you can see the picture here is picture fish. So this is a fish. So you color here fish. Okay, what is the missing part of the body here? Dia nak tanya Balkis lah terus jawab semua. Okay Balkis, what is the missing part of the body? Scales. Ha? Scales. Right here. Scale ada ni. Yang ni, ni scale. Apa yang ni? Yes. Fish. Fish tu yang bantu fish tu untuk berenang. Okay, fish ni yang tak ada. Okay, what is the function of missing part of the body for this animal? Untuk swimming ke jumping? Swimming. Okay, very good. Swimming. Okay, color the correct answer. Okay, what is other part of this animal body? Ada apa lagi selain fin, selain scale? Ada apa? Ada tail tak? Ada. You have to color tail. Ada body? Ada. The head? Ada. Yes. Are the scale? Ada. Yes. Do they have horn? No. No. Wing? No. no. So you uh, no need to color. So just color tail, body, head and also scale. And the last question, you have to draw the missing part of the fish above. Apa yang hilang tadi? Fins. So you have to draw fin. Okay, how to draw fin? Okay, fin. Okay, satu lagi fin dekat sini. Okay, you have to draw yeah, fin. This is the fin. Okay, fin is very important to his feet for them to swim in. Okay, I hope all of you can understand about the topic animals, the body part of the animals and why the body part of animal is important. Okay, have you done? Copy the answer. Okay, have you done? Okay, Alpha done. If you can, you can show me your thumbs up. Okay, done. Good. Okay, most of you done because this is color only. Amiro Farhan nanti buat, okay? Okay, that's all for today. So, I will stop share my slide here. Okay, that's all for today. So, I hope all of you can understand our exercise and topic for today. Today, we have learned about animal, the body of the animal. So, uh, why they are important to the animal? Okay, before we end our lesson, let's recite Surah 1 together. 1, 2, 3. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Wa'as. Inna 
Bye, Bye. 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 Bye.